Hey guys, it's Michelle Tatenda. So in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you all a review and demo on the St. Ives Blackhead Clearing Green Tea Scrub. And this clears blackheads and calms redness. It's, yeah. So this is oil-free and also has acne medication in it. And it has 100% um, natural exfoliants. It's sulfate-free and paraben-free as well. So, so I use this twice a week maximum and um, every single day what I do is I just take a little bit and I apply it on my nose and I'm just gonna go ahead and show you all how I do that I just, and um, it looks just like this it's very grainy uh, the smell delightful I, I, I really like the smell of it um, you know it'll it will it'll it definitely um, it fills the room up as well and so what I do is I just work this into my skin into my nose and on a daily basis because this is this for me is like my problem area is my nose yeah. so and then I just wash it off when I'm washing the rest of my face you know, recently um, you, um they a, a study came out on st. eyes and you know they said that um, you know it, it can be really abrasive or cause like skin damage so when using St. Ives um, products I highly recommend that you do your own research you know if you uh, if you don't want to buy like a full bottle like this in the travel sections they have like the you know sample size or travel size little one so I recommend that you try that you know buy one of those um, I th um less under two dollars so you want to um, buy one of those and try it out on your skin and if it's a, you know abrasive you know of course don't use it so you, and then of course you haven't spent a lot of money buying a huge thing that you know you'll have to like give away or whatever it is that you do so yeah um, definitely do your research and so um, twice a week what I do is I focus on my chin here and so I have um, you know of course a, a no makeup on. <laughs> I didn't even feel in my eyebrows. I was like, let me just come on here and just be as, um, you know. Yeah, this is me. <laughs> and I uh, and and I did put some um, Bantu knots in my hair. So I just work this. And then you, of course, um, again, you really want to avoid your eye area. So far, this has not harmed my skin in any way. And I've used St. Ice products for years and years and years. And for me, they do their job at like scrubbing your face and getting rid of like excess dirt and makeup that's really ground in your, in your pores and things like that. Is it blackhead clearing? I really think it's just getting my, my pores very, very clean. I think the more you use it, the, the more that it will clear your face. And also I wanted to share with y'all, this also has like an expiration date and this expires like in 2018. So if you know, you guys find, um, um, and really like them you just like you know or there's a deal going on if I want to get one free or anything like that I just store them in like a cool dark place and you know always of course watch out for the expiration date so with I've said this before as well but with every um, thing that I put on my face I always bring it down whatever I put on my face I always add on my neck because your neck it really is a part of your 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 face and from moisturizer to you know any masks or anything like that I always try to unless it's like one of those paper masks like I've done paper um, ones that I've done you know previously that don't have like a neck thing but I always make sure to in an upward way always always up you don't want to ever um, rub your neck downward always up, up up even when you're putting like moisturizer on up 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 I don't know why my mom taught me that and I and I also like um, read it somewhere but everything in an upward way I guess you just don't want to weigh your skin down I don't know <laughs> but it works and hey it's been um, you know doing quite well for my skin so yeah I just wanted to share that with y'all so whatever um, anything I put on my face I always wait at least five minutes so I'll just like wash the rest of my body and then um, wash my face at the very end so what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm not gonna wash my face or any of that on camera but what I will do is I wanted to share with you all how this kind of lather how this lathers up when you when you like add a lot of water to it so I'm actually gonna show you all that in five minutes so, as you can see when you add water 
to it, it just starts to lather up and the grains, um, they're still there, but they become a lot softer. And yeah, guys, I just wanted to share that quickly with you all. For the purpose of this video, I was like, let me just quickly wash out at the sink. And now after I finish with this video, I'm going to have to go wipe <laughs> the sink down. Um, like you can see like water all over like my my shirt and everything so yeah that's why i always wash my face in the shower but um yeah so, so i just wanted to um come on here and share with you all what my face looks like and how it feels very very smooth very smooth after um using this mask okay. and so does my neck as well what i share with you all is um products that i bought myself or actually this face mask my sister bought for herself and i just kind of grabbed it <laughs> so um you know this is honest reviews from me. What I also wanted to share with you all is that I'm going to be writing a full blog um, and inside is going to be like a review and I'll also share the videos, um, all the past ones that I have done and you know maybe include like pictures as well of all the face masks that I've used until now. So be sure and check that out. I'm going to leave the link to my website in the description box. Uh, yeah, so leave a comment. Let me know um, y'all's favorites. Um, you can leave comments here on YouTube and you can also leave comments on my website as well and share with, you know, if you, um, how you found a lot of these masks. Also, what are some of your favorites I'd actually like to try. So guys, that is all for this one. I do thank you all for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe until my next video. Be blessed. Enjoy. Bye guys.